So in this video we're going to uh, create uh, our WordPress website. So I'm going to go to websites, I'm going to find mine, there we go. Right now my website looks like this and I'm going to install WordPress. So I'm going to go to cPanel, I'm going to type in This is my UH eight digit UH ID. Okay, so uh, this is what cPanel looks like when you log in. And uh, you can take a look at some of these things and we aren't gonna do anything except for uh, we're gonna use the MySQL databases later on. PHP my admin later on. That's if you do the uh, database WordPress database assignment. Right now we're just going to install WordPress. So find this under software and services. Find this fantastical F3. Click on it. And over on the left here, look for blogs. Click on blogs, and then scroll down to the bottom and find WordPress. Click on that. And we come here and says we've passed the requirements. Click here to install a new copy. And we come here, uh, leave this blank, type in the username, and I'd like you to type in the same username as your login. And my email address. And then a title, you can put uh, my cool website, some such thing. We can change that later. I'll show you how to do that. Click Submit. And um, click Proceed. This is where we update WordPress, the, the, the back end, the um, um, dashboard, and this is our website. And so now we can just click here, and now my website is installed. If we go back to Business three, USA 345, and just um, go back here to our website, we can click on websites and now when we go down here and look at mine this is what I get <clears throat> now let me quickly show you how to uh, how to change the name my cool website and actually I'm going to install another theme also so I'm going to do, do uh, first I'm going to install another theme then I'm going to uh, change my cool website so I'm going to go to the login here and I'm going to log in with my login And I'm going to remember it for myself. And here's the dashboard. Now, to uh, change the theme, you just go to Appearance Themes. And these are the themes that come with WordPress when you first install them. But you might not like any of these, so you can click Add New. And here's a bunch of other themes that WordPress offers. Uh, there's, there's hundreds and hundreds of them. So you can click on popular and look at these popular themes. There's many different themes. I actually like the Z Vision theme. And it's this one, you'll notice that's the way. Uh, so I can just click on and you can preview it. This is what our website would look like. This is what it looks like. Let's go back. Uh, eh. I went back too far. 
and so let's just install it install and you can do a live preview or activate I'm just going to go ahead and activate it and now when I click on up here to go back to your website we you see now this is the new theme uh, if you want to change this here this works for all themes go back to the dashboard and come down to appearance and go to customize and this comes up and we can go to site identity and this comes up and I can say my very cool website um, uh, Rich Halverson's website for PUSA 345. How's that? And we see that there. We can click Save and Publish. And click X. And we can always go back to the site by clicking this up here. And now you notice the name has changed. And now it looks like this. So if you have any questions, uh, just let me know. Thank you.